it's been a long road, but we've come pretty far and she's doing fantastic. What's it like having her in your home? Just like having an extra dog any other day. She's really no different. Plays, gets along with everybody. You guys have other dogs? Yes, we have a dog that's one month older than her. And they play? Very yes, together. they play very well together. How early on did you meet Sunny when all this happened? Um, I think about a week after the incident, she was brought into veterinary emergency service. What was it like seeing her in the way she was when she first came in? Um, the most horrific thing that I've ever seen, especially in my career. Um, just, it's pretty unimaginable what she looked like when she came in. And what made you want to bring her into your home? Um, she, with everything she went through and the condition she was in, she rolled over on her back and wanted me to pet her belly. So it's kind of an instant connection with you. Right? So. Yes. Um, I guess what's it been like being able to watch her either heal and kind of come back to being a normal dog? Um, it's pretty amazing. We didn't think that it would go this quick. We thought it was going to be months and months of pretty horrific changes going on with her. But um, after about a week and she was really good and starting to act like a dog, I never thought she would be acting like a dog this quick. But She's running and playing and jumping and demanding treats. Do you think it was um, beneficial for Sunny's um, healing that uh, she did go home with your family, having with you having knowledge of animal care and treatment? Um, most definitely, if she needed anything, I was there, and she's always with me. So, um, if I, she was uncomfortable and needed more pain control. I was able to detect that and get her more comfortable. Mm -hmm. So this is a special case where you brought your work home with you? Yes. She's so cute. Did we could tell when she came in that she was a good dog. Uh, I mean, she was hiding and shaking and um, fearful and probably would have been if I pushed her too hard because she was in such pain but I could tell that she was you know a gentle dog and um, she's learned to trust her foster family and um, my medical team she hates me actually uh, every time she sees me she's like no she's going to put me with something but she trusts me um, but I'm always surprised by um, how well dogs uh, get over trauma yeah wow um, so how long uh, do you think it'll take until Sunny kind of starts um, to be f or until Sunny's fully healed, or is that ever possible? She'll never be completely normal. Mm -hmm. I figure we have about another month mm -hmm. until she's out of the complete clear. Mm -hmm. But I don't expect her ears to ever ever look normal again. They're going to be scarred up and kind of crinkly like they are now. And uh, she, lots of her body still won't have fur for the rest of her life. Okay. But some areas will then grow the mm -hmm. fur back? Yeah. Okay. Well, I guess one thing is I wasn't actually expecting her to heal this fast. It's kind of um, amazing mm -hmm. how well she's done. And I was expecting her to look this way probably in one or two more months. Mm -hmm. So I'm really um, happy with her progress. Right here. Are you done with me? Hey, I was really good for a long time. Aww.